We'll have the choir number first. And the choir will then go down. what we preached about this morning yes. the all sufficiency of Christ yes. but it, it just it just fits so wonderfully from yes. the it's prelude really, to really it. Beautiful. it was just wonderful thank you Jesus it was so good isn't the Lord wonderful yes. thank you Jesus oh thank you, Lord. yes Oh, I'm thankful. And I want to thank more than anything. Just to have you in 
Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Oh, my. Next time the choir members speak, you can run that mic or this mic up to them. Isn't the Lord wonderful? Oh, my. I'm already astonished that Jesus would love us so much to help us feed us, make us feel at home. Well, choir, that was so good. Steve will sing next. And then after that, Ann will sing. Then after that, uh, is Richard and uh, Don both here together? Either Richard or Don or... Uh, Don himself, I'm not sure. That's the next one. Um, after that, Barry. Touches me on Barry. Yes, the Lord touches me on Barry. Is uh, Dan back at church yet? Don't see him yet. In that order, if you'll follow one right after the other. Steve, you'll sing while the choir goes down. The choir can just go down. Steve will start singing. Okay. The rest of you follow one right after the other immediately. I've learned to know a name I highly treasure. Oh, how it thrills my spirit through and through. Oh, precious name beyond degree or measure. Oh, kind and true. My heart is stirred whenever I think of Jesus, that blessed name which sets the captive free. so much to me that name brings gladness to a soul in sorrow it makes life shadows and its tears depart brings strength and weakness for today Tomorrow that name brings healing to an aching heart. My heart is turned whenever I think of Jesus that blessed said name which sets the captive free the only name through which I find salvation no name on earth has meant so much to me 
that name still lives and will live on forever while kings and kingdoms will forgotten be through mist or rain twill be be clouded never the captive free Get right ready. Just as soon as the next singer stops, just go right, right, one right after the other. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Praise the holy name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Okay. All right. Is there somebody with a song on their heart can just get up and sing while we're waiting? A little hard for them to follow just immediately. Barry's got his ready? Okay, well, they're ready. They're getting ready. Hallelujah. You can even come and stand if I call your name and get ready to go. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, it's all right. Hallelujah.
it up like that. Oh, precious Jesus. Richard, we're so glad you're here. Glory to God. He came in ahead of the group by a few days. It is so wonderful to have him here. He's not, he's not sure he's able to play. Yes. I feel so naked being up here by myself. Yes, he, 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 and I. Uh, and he felt so naked being up here by himself. He was usually, you know, his brothers with him in the group. And, but uh, I almost lost my brother last night. He's a police officer. Yes. yes. <laughs> and he got shot. Oh, he did. Oh, he funny. didn't get. He didn't get hurt bad, but. Yes. You know, someone shot at him. It yeah. was a yes. It was a domestic disturbance, and yes, yes, I know. And he he got shot at, and he got hurt, but the person still had the gun on him, and uh, and he talked the man to put the gun down, even after the you know he got hurt by him. Yes. And uh, I just thought, you know, I just feel so alone up here without him, because I'm used to having him. Sure. And uh. And I just thought how, you know, that that I, I miss him. Yeah. 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 And uh, so I, I just thought it'd be appropriate if I can sing it. It's uh, a song called Home Where I Belong. And it sure touches my heart. We want to thank the Lord that his brother wasn't killed. Yeah. We want to remember to pray for him yeah. as often as possible because all of our police officers are into this now. And uh, the domestic disturbances are the kind where they get shot a lot. They try to help, and then they turn on the officer. Mm -hmm. And it's quite, a, it's quite a situation. But we thank God for protecting him, that by God's grace in a few days he'll be here. How good to have Richard here tonight. Praise the Lord. Say that heaven's pretty and living here is too. But if they said that I would have to choose between the two, I'd go. I'm going where I. When I'm feeling lonely And when I'm feeling blue It's such a joy to know That I am only passing through Cause I'm going home I'm going home Where I belong While I'm here, I'll serve him gladly, sing him all these songs. I'm here, but not for long. Sometimes when I'm sleeping, it comes as no surprise. When I look, I see the homesick feeling. My eyes, I'm going home. I'm going home where I belong. While 
While I'm here, I'll serve him gladly, sing him all these songs. I'm here, but not for long. One day I'll be sleeping when death knocks on my door, and I awake to find that I'm not homesick. I'll be home. I'm going home where I belong. Since Jesus came my way, redeemed my soul and turned my night to day. How very rich! How very rich I am! Such peace and joy I never knew before, and countless blessings from His boundless store. How very rich! How very rich I am. There's a greater glory in a sunset, a brighter twinkle in a star. There's much more promise in a rainbow, more music in a singing bird. All things have changed, my eyes once blind can see. The whole wide world is now a symphony. And with all this, heaven is my destiny. How rich I am! Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, glory. Thank you, Jesus. Number 496, let us break bread together.
time since the church has all been on their knees. It used to, some years ago, the Holy Spirit would lead us, who all who were able. Some are not able, but most are able to get on their knees. And so, let us go to our knees to break bread together in prayer and to praise the Lord. Dad will, uh, I guess it's Terry praying for us. Let us pray together. Our Father, we come to Thee with thanksgiving tonight, breaking bread together. Lord, for the privilege to get upon our knees, we're so thankful, Lord. We kneel before Thee, Jesus, for there's coming a time, Lord, when all knees shall bow. Every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Blessed art the blessed art thou, Father, tonight. We're so thankful for Jesus. We're so thankful that you loved us, Lord, that you sent your son Jesus to come and die on the cross of Calvary for our sins. We're thankful for the price that was paid tonight that Jesus shed his precious blood and we believe in the power of the blood tonight. Yes. Oh God, we come to thee yes, with Lord. thanksgiving. We come and thank you, Lord. We're thankful, Jesus, for the bread thou hast given us today. Thou hast been precious, O Lord. Thou hast fed us from heaven today and we're thankful for it, Jesus. Jesus. By faith we look unto thee tonight. By faith we come with thanksgiving tonight. Amen. By faith we praise thee tonight. We praise thee, Lord, upon our knees for thou art worthy of all praise. Blessed be Jesus, God above Blessed be the Lamb that was slain on Amen. Calvary. Blessed be the Holy Ghost tonight. We're so Amen. thankful, Lord, for thy presence. Oh, God, to sense thy presence is everything. To know that God is with Jesus, us, oh that's Jesus. what matters, is it God's will. To do it, to seek the will of God and do it, that's our goal, Jesus, to trust in thee, to yes, please Lord. thee, oh, Lord, we're thankful. We're thankful tonight. We're thankful, Jesus. I thank you, Lord, for the congregation tonight, oh, for the congregation of saints tonight. We praise Amen. thee, oh, God. God. We thank you now for this privilege, Lord, as we look unto thee, blessed oh, God, our Father. Blessed. We're thankful tonight. Lord, we pray tonight you'll reach down and pity our littleness tonight. Oh, oh God, have mercy upon us. I plead for thy spirit to move tonight. Oh, I thank you, Lord, for helping in the songs, Lord, as we looked unto thee. Oh, we're so thankful for the gift of music. Amen. We're thankful for the people that have vocal cords that will respond. Amen. For a heart to sing most of all. For hearts pure before thee. Yes, for hearts Lord. that lift thee. Jesus, we're thankful, Lord. Oh, my heart is stirred whenever I think of Amen. Jesus. Glory be to God tonight. We're thankful, Jesus, and we praise Thee. I thank You for everyone that sang. I thank You for Sally. I thank You for the music, Lord, that comes forth from the piano. Yes, we're thankful, Jesus. We praise Thee tonight. And Lord, I pray You look upon our hearts tonight now. Lord, oh, blessed God, You're a God that does. You look upon the heart. Man looks on the Amen. outward appearance, but God, our Father, looks upon the heart. Yes, Lord. Oh God, let the blood come and do its work tonight. Jesus. Let the Holy Ghost come tonight and cleanse the fresh, cleanse the congregation of fresh, cleanse the sanctuary tonight, Lord, as we honor thee, as Amen. we kneel before thee, may you do thy work upon us. Yes. Oh God, may the searchlight of heaven come down. Amen. Open up tonight and let the searchlight come in and search out the quarters of our hearts. Oh God, drive out any darkness, I pray now. Yes, oh God, drive out any darkness, for we know the heart is deceitful and wicked above all oh, things. Jesus. Who can know it? But God knows oh, it. God Jesus. sees it. And God cares. He created us for His pleasure. And Lord, unless our heart is clean, we cannot please Thee. Oh, so Jesus. let the blood be applied tonight. Oh, blessed God, we pray. We pray for an application of the blood. We plead that precious blood. We pray the forces of darkness to take flight in Jesus' name. Oh, God, we're thankful. I thank You for my brothers and sisters, Lord. I thank You that we can call upon thee, that we can ask for that cleansing and believe God for it, and believe that God is doing the work. We're thankful, Jesus. We praise thee tonight. Blessed be the God above. Hallelujah. Glory, glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We praise thee, O oh God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We adore thee, Jesus. We're so thankful for you. Thank you, Lord. We praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, that you care for every one of us. You care, Lord, and we're to cast our burdens upon you. Cast your cares upon the Lord, for he cared for you. Thank you for that opportunity to tonight, Jesus. We thank you. We praise thee, O oh God. We thank you, Lord. We're trusting in thee now. Oh, Lord, we're believing God for revival. We're believing God for revival in the hearts of the people. We're believing God to take care of the problems and situations. We're believing God for healing tonight. Heal that when it's in pain, O oh Lord, I pray tonight. Remove the pain, I pray. Skill that cancer
cancer, Lord, I pray in Jesus' name. May cancers die tonight. Uh, those cancers in the body, may they shrivel tonight and be gone. May they dry up in Jesus' holy name. We plead thy precious blood. Oh, God, and heal the spiritual cancers tonight. Heal any unhealthy growth, we pray. Stop it now, Jesus, we pray. Cut it out. We pray in thy holy name. May that growth be healthy. We pray for a healthy growth, for a healthy body. We pray for the limbs and the organs to function properly. Tonight, let it be so that we may honor thee, Jesus, that you may have a body that you can rest your head and you can lead and guide by thy spirit. Oh, God, lead in the remainder of the spirit, in the remainder of this service by thy spirit, we pray. And we'll thank you for it, Jesus. Thank you for the leadership of the Holy Spirit. Thank you for helping our pastor tonight. Thank you, Lord, for the songs, how they were a lift to us, how they thrilled our hearts and helped us. Lord, we want to honor thee and please thee in all of our way. May we not embarrass thee, Jesus, but may we please thee by our, our actions, words, and deeds, by our thoughts. You who can see the imagination of our thoughts, O oh God, I pray they'll be pleasing unto thee this night. For thy glory we do pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Jeannie will sing. Come on up, something about sail on. She said you're not quite ready, but I believe the Lord wants you to sing it. Sally, you start playing it now. Glory. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Wonderful being on our knees, wasn't it? Amen. Glory. <laughs> Hallelujah. Is anybody whose heart just throbbing like a trip hammer? The Holy Spirit's dealing with you. Thank Glory you. to God. We're trying to obey the Lord as quick as we can.
weren't quite ready, but they were ready. Hallelujah. And now Jeannie sings right away. Kids, you go down quietly while she's singing. Wonderful. I thought I might. Yeah. Amen. Praise the Lord. such a great time. Oh, glory. We're, we're having such a great time. I, I said, Stephen, do, do you think there's anybody in here except you that knows what a miracle is taking place? And the reason I said except him is because when we got up off of our knees, I said, start playing over genius numbers. And uh, he had an operation on one and I, I said, pray on, keep praying. I didn't know what it was. I just said, keep praying. That's not it. Now, all he told me was two. Now, he doesn't know why he had the operation on two. I said, pray on. Now, see, we're just, well, we don't know what to do. Oh, only God helps you know to do that. That's all I know. You didn't know what number Hold two on, I was. Hold on, I didn't know anything. I just looked at him. I said, pray on. Pray, keep praying, Steve. Keep praying. <laughs> Started walking towards Sally so she would be ready because when... But there's only two or three times in 14 years I felt that we should just keep going. Just don't let it break. Just keep going. Even a while ago, if that person obeyed the Lord that I called for it, had the, the joy of the Lord on their heart, if they just heard me and responded right then, there's sometimes yes, He sir. wants it moving. Touches he just wants heart. it moving. Touches See, and I can feel it somehow. I can feel it within me. Oh, yes. Not to hesitate, to obey because souls need so much without any hesitation what's okay. coming. So God just, boy, oh, just, and you know, you know, <laughs> I, I'm either crazy or I trust him like a child. You've got one or the other. I'm either, I'm, I belong in the nut house or I'm just, I just simply believe God and trust him like a child. Because, see, in a service like this, you can't afford to miss it. If you miss it, it throws the whole service off. You've got to trust Him. I've got to trust Him. I've got to believe what He's telling me. I've got to believe it when I feel it move within me. See, it's so wonderful. 
And Stephen just say, well, I said, start praying over Jeannie's nervous. Huh, touch me on too. I said, pray on. Keep praying. Well, I don't know what two is. I just told him, keep praying. Isn't that wonderful? Uh, there's something about... <laughs> and this well, I was sitting here wondering if Jeannie chose it or if, if you prayed about it. Prayed but about I it. knew that it was lifting me and it was so beautiful. And I knew that it was Jesus speaking to me. And I'm thankful. I, I can tell that he's really in that. It's so good. That, is, that helps me so much. Oh, blessed Jesus. See, it's so wonderful to trust him. It's so wonderful to be like a child. Now, for him to help me to lead a service where he's, where he's moving rapidly like that. See, I just had to leap, just take a leap and say, Jesus, I need thee. Oh, God, I'm trusting thee. But it's such joy. It's, it's just so great. See, he said, get like a child. Just trust me like a child. I'm going to help you. And he's just, oh, it's been so wonderful. You know, that Ceylon was good, wasn't it? Oh, it was telling us a story, wasn't it? And you know, it's it in keeping what it said. He said, keep it moving, keep it moving. Boy, I mean, it said, say long, keep going. I thought, oh, Jesus, this is so great. How could it be better than him helping like this? Are, are you getting blessed? Are you feeding from? See, God just, and the choir started that number. Wasn't it good? Oh, that was just, oh, nothing more than him. I said, Jesus, this is so good. Then have him go down. And the songs keep rolling. The singers keep singing. God keeps blessing. And then here's this beautiful number that talks to us about trusting him like a child. Oh, it's so great. It really is. I wanted to sing it again before she quits. moments because they're great treasures. Hallelujah. 484. O Father, Thou who give us all. 484. Congregation will stand.
Jesus. Praise the Lord. Number 473. Touch my heart on tender blessings from above. Amen. That's what God's been doing for us tonight. Right there. Hallelujah. Amen. Anyone that feels led to sing a song tonight, uh, please come to me during the singing of this number, please. wonderful to us. Amen. Praise the Lord. Let us be seated. And hallelujah. Amen. Glory. <laughs> Blessed of his spirit washed in his blood this is my story this is my song praising the savior all the day long this is my story this is my song praising thy savior all the day long Perfect submission, perfect delight, visions of rapture now burst on my sight. Angels descending bring from above, echoes of mercy, whispers of love. This is my story, this is my song. Praising my Savior all the day long. Hallelujah. This is my story. This is my song. Praising my Savior all the day long. Perfect submission, all is at rest. I and my Savior am happy and blessed. Watching and waiting, looking above, Hallelujah. filled with His goodness, lost in His love. Sing with Him. This is my story. This is my song.
glory to God. Paul, we got as much witness on you singing as about any song we've had. Glory to God. We had this to happen last Sunday morning with a man that God got on an elder of the church and I'm telling you, he praised God and he praised God. I think it lasted about an hour and he'd praise God. I could, I'd try to settle down, but he'd praise God and I had, I thought I was going to run and shout. It kept up and up and up simply because a layman right out of the audience said, well, I have a song on my heart and I want to obey God just like Paul did here tonight. Isn't it wonderful? Yeah. Glory to God forevermore. Congregation, you may be seated. Yes. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. <clears throat> One night this week, he came to me, and the Lord asked me to remember him in prayer. Yes. I don't know why, of all the young people, that Paul would come before me. But I want to thank God for his life. Amen. And pray that he will undergird him and direct him in the right path as long as he's faithful and obedient to what God calls me to do. God will be with him. I can, I'm assured of that. Praise Bless you, Lord. Paul. Yeah. His obedience has blessed us. Perfect delight. Hallelujah. Oh, speak to me from heaven above. Fill thou my soul that I may know thy love, thy wondrous love. Hush my heart to hear thy faintest whisper. Speak, dear Lord, speak, dear Lord. Oh, may my will be lost in thine, my yielded heart. Now resign, speak, Lord, I pray, that the flood tide of thy glory, like a mighty sea, sweep o'er me, while I worship and adore thy name, thy matchless name, precious holy name, through eternal years. Speak to me from Calvary, where thou, O Christ, didst shed thy blood for me in agony. Speak of thy undying mercy to me, there outpoured, precious Lord. Oh, melt my heart with Calvary love, burn out the dross with fire from above. Speak, Lord, I pray. Speak from Calvary, I implore thee, keep that vision ever be. I hear coming out besides lovely tones it's doing my heart good praise his holy name heart and I, oh, I was shaking so much yeah. Jesus was helping yeah. Yeah. Now, it shook. wasn't nerves yeah, I, know. I, I know that it's the way God works with you I shook like that this morning now some singers shake, shake like that all the time but what I want to share with the audience is that in singing there is a release of the heart that cannot be had in any other way. Therefore, I believe that all of us will sing in heaven. I believe that all of us will. 
But there is a release of the heart. There is a commitment. There is a change in the life as one sings from the heart that cannot be had in any other way. And so I uh, had this leading that anybody who feels led to sing and all of you have responded and we've been blessed. We've heard precious things. Praise the Lord. Faith. Oh, that's right. She brought you in. That's right. Praise the Lord. Our God hath given promise and His grace for this has planned His child shall rest securely in the hollow of his hand let come what may or wave or tempest peace be still is his command my soul is held in peace Thou, though, though thou dost not understand, no turmoil shall molest thee in the hollow of his hand. Let come what may. My soul is held in 
The ushers will come forward for the Sunday evening offering. Father, thou art witnessing peace be still. We thank thee that thou art speaking, and we know that. Uh, what the singer just before? Anna. Anna was speaking. I speak to me, Lord. Yes. And while Faye was singing, you spoke. That's right. Where you said, "Peace be still." Peace be still. There's where you witnessed. And I think how wonderful that the Holy Spirit would invite the message from God and then God would give the answer yes. and if, uh, if we have hearing ears and trusting hearts then the Lord has given us the message that we need yes. we're so very thankful Lord help us to retain it tonight yes. as we go out of the service into the morrow and as we walk into the lonely place sanctify this offering and thank thee for the faithfulness of our people thank, we want to thank you for every paycheck that came in this week. We want to thank you for taking care of every need, thank whether there was a paycheck or not. We want to praise you, Father, for each provision and all that thou hast done this last week, especially for the nourishment for our souls. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Lord. Haven't known quite how to go with this, even though I knew four days ago I was to speak today sometime. Just been trusting, and when Oliver mentioned something about everyone singing in heaven and the release, I had a little inspiration. This is something I wrote uh, in March of 79. And... Uh, it stems from this fellowship teaches differently than most any churches I know of and that everything is not a, you know, things are material and heaven is not a, it is something real and heaven, um, correct me if I'm wrong, is a much amplified version of the joy we experience here. What? Right. Well, I've often wondered if hell wouldn't be the opposite, an amplified version of the agony that we experience here. Dead sinner. So, 
But um, I didn't want to dwell on that. <laughs> uh, uh, this is something I haven't even looked just in ages, so forgive me. And I have an eye appointment in the morning. I'm not seeing well for the first time in my life. It's, it's really strange. I see perfectly out of my right eye. In the last two months, my left eye has gone completely blurry. I guess it's a sign of age or something. Problem. I entitled this Band of Glory. Trumpets blare a mighty blast. The end has come, heaven, at last. They ring out the praises to the great I am, and all the saints begin to jam. Their blowing shakes the old earth away, for the new tomorrow has come this day. All things have a beautiful, bright, and new facade. Horns Universal shout, glory to God. The hills are alive with the music at hand, while Gabriel leads the band of all bands. <laughs> Dixieland gospel has come into its own. Oh, such wonderful heavenly tones. Voices of praise fill the pure air. Everyone sings as good as Jeannie up there. <laughs> Dick and Sally walk hand in hand marveling at the music in God's eternally promised land. Oh, Bobby, that's so great. <laughs> oh, that is so wonderful. Did you hear that? That's wonderful. Boy, the young people like that, too. That's great. I marvel that he said everyone would sing as good as Jeannie up there. And I've tried to tell you a little a few moments before that we're all going to sing up there. Praise the Lord. That's so good. That's good. We waited on that for several days. By His grace. We love your spirit. We do. I think you're still very young. And uh, it's, I think it's over 40 where the eyes start going. <laughs> but it, it is wonderful. You had seen your brother jump and shout just two weeks ago it would have blessed your heart very good because in all the years that I've known him I, I've not heard his voice above what I'm speaking now but uh, it was shouting in fact his spirit was much like the spirit of your poem there praise the Lord thank you Bobby that's wonderful Now Steve and Linda are going to sing for us. <laughs> Remember how lovely it was the last time they sung? Now I doubt if James ever heard them sing. Debbie, how many have never heard them sing? Oh my, my. Well, they're going to sing right now. By God's grace. Hallelujah. Glory. They're lovely to see. I had a wonderful time with them yesterday. Just wonderful. Just blessed. And I was broken up at the mall when I heard Stephen say to Norman Oliver, I heard him say, Norman Oliver. And when he did, the fire went through me. And I grabbed my, my chest like this to keep from weeping. Because I heard something that uh, told me that I was connected, you know, that there was a connection here. When he said Norman Oliver, praise the Lord. Well, we well I don't even know what you did last time. Does it? There's a mansion over the hill. You don't want to do that. What well, do you want to do, Linda? <laughs> it's about the only thing we can do, I think. Whatever you do is going to help us. Whatever you do is going to help us now. I guess you, it you just could, could be that. that. That would be good. She's got it over okay. there. Linda, Linda doesn't want, wants to, but wants to, but we're going to do it by God's grace. <laughs> Boy, she's had a harder assignment for me than this. One night, she got under the glory one night in the back of the old church, and boy, God was a helping, and I mean he was helping. And she hit the floor and said something like this, that we better shape up or ship out. Amen. And I mean it was true, and it was great. Well, <clears throat> someone 
called her or called her husband, yes. called her, told her she was out, out of divine order. That she was demon possessed. I didn't know that till now. That's great you didn't tell me that. I tell you, those folks who don't know what a holy fight is, if I'd known that. Because well, brother is rough enough as it was. And uh, I didn't tell God's servant what was going on. I said, I just want to be sure I'm in divine order. Am I to face this head on or back off? He said, God tells me you're to face it head on. Boy, Wednesday night, I told her to get o come over and get ready. And she thought that I was going to have her come over and apologize. But I was having her come over so I could back her from the pulpit. And I preached a message on submission that night. And I'm to never have I faced the church head on like I did that night. But God was with me. Next day, I got another call. Oh, I mean some man's voice is about to chew me up. I said, brother, were you here last night? He said, no. Then I said, I don't think you have a right to speak. Boy, God was faithful. You seldom have you heard me like that. But I wanted them to know. I told the congregation that this woman was pure. And she loved everybody in the world. And her husband had told me for years that she didn't take anybody apart at home. He told me that for years. And yet this woman called her and said she's out of divine order and she was demon possessed. Well, I knew that wasn't right. But see, I didn't know tonight that that person said that. I didn't know that at all. So I'm real glad I didn't. Because you've really never seen me, you know, really in holy war. But uh, there would have been one that time. God's faithful. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. Boy, when somebody calls someone pure, something like that, I'm telling you, you've never seen my father stirred. Probably five or six times in my life have I seen him really stirred. Never over anybody cutting him down. Nothing over himself. But when they get after some little lamb, someone who loves Jesus, then my father is a man to face. Friends, I'm telling you, don't you ever provoke him. You'll be sorry that you did. I mean, he'll be under the holy banner. And friends, you wished you'd never said what you did if you got after some little lamb. See, see, Jesus said it'd be better that a millstone were hung about your neck and you were cast in the depths of the sea. See, it'd be better that that man were never born than to have done something like that. So all these years, Jesus has helped me never to do that one time. By God's yes, grace. Think of it. Never to do it once in 44 years. I've, be God's grace. I've never done it once in 44 years. And God tells you in your heart that's true. I've never let the carnal wrath get out of me after a lamb. By God's grace, it'll only be through Jesus that I can last 44 more or until Jesus comes. But because of my father and mother, because of my daddy's spirit, I never cut up a little lamb so that it would have been better than a millstone be hung about my neck. See, I'm so thankful to Jesus. And I want to praise him. Jesus said, only be true you that will not hurt somebody. And uh, it, you're the only one that can help us in the next hours and days. Jesus, we need thee so much. But thank the Lord for this. All right, Stephen, Linda. Yes. Oh, you have. Why, Betty? See, I wanted you to see them. You only heard them once. That's all they've sung in 12 years. But this is number two. Glory. I just wanted you to see them together and hear their precious voices. I see the lady singing out there. Did you ever see such a sight in your life? <laughs> oh, my. I'm satisfied with just a cottage below, a little silver and a little gold. But in that city where the ransomed will shine, I want a gold. That silver line I've got a mansion Just over the hilltop In that bright land Where 
will never grow old and someday yonder we will never more wonder but walk the streets that are purest gold though often tempted tormented and tested and like the prophet my pillow was stone and though I find here no permanent dwelling I know he'll give me a mansion my own Just over the hilltop In that bright land where We'll never grow old And someday yonder We will never more wander But walk on streets that Are pure as Don't think me poor or deserted or lonely. I'm not discouraged. We're heaven bound. Hallelujah! <laughs> the pilgrim in search of a city. I want a mansion, a harp and a crown. I've got a mansion just over the hilltop in the... Nevermore wander, but walk the streets that are purest gold. I tell you, that's near heaven. I want them to go back and love Arlene and notice. Now, Arlene, just weeping while you're singing. Thank you. They've, they've uh, suffered with you and We've gone through a lot together, so you'll go back and love Otis for us, and she'll love Arlene. I'm telling you. Of course, Stephen, you can love Arlene, too. You can just have at it. Glory. Thank you, Jesus. I mean, that we oh, God's so good to us. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord is so great to us. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Wasn't that just about as sweet as you could hear? <laughs> the Lord just full of surprises. I looked back there and I watched them. I said, oh, uh, there's such love coming up here. Tell it's so great. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Because of Steve and Linda, wife and I had a wonderful meal yesterday yeah. afternoon. Yes. I was driving from here to our little white home just over the hill top. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I... Uh, Passed Linda there about the hardware store, and I saw it was raining. She had a box in her hand. I stopped and picked it up. I knew she was headed down the house. I knew she was coming, and got down there and took out of that box a, a cooked duck, old-fashioned hunter style, with rice, and had the best sauce. I don't know whenever I've tasted sauce as any better in all of my life. And we sat down and ate a meal with. Well, relished it so wonderfully much that I don't think I'll ever get over it. I thank God for a couple like uh, Steve yes, and amen. Linda. You know, we're Good fixing pleasure. them up a little cottage over here. And uh, that may be it till Jesus comes, but there's a mansion over on the other side. I want you to know that because of Lloyd and Terry and the men of the church, uh, it's going to be a beautiful little place. And it's a dream come true for us. By God's grace, because I've wanted them in a place in a little yard for Norman. And uh, 
they tell me now. I see, you know, going up, but I just see that it's going to be real nice and that uh, it's a real mm-hmm. blessing. Think of this. Rodney's back here in the parsonage I came in. Daddy and mother have a new home just over the hill over here. Yes. And uh, Steve and Linda have this little cottage. And Dave and uh, Kathy are right over here. Terry and Martha are back here. My brother and, and Kathy just above them. It's kind of a wonderful place, don't you think? Yes. Well, I tell you, this church is surrounded. And uh, surrounded by wonderful couples that love Jesus. Would you stand 453 and sing the church's jubilee, Pastor? 453. Oh, I think the truth in this song is fits just now. Hallelujah. <laughs> the light of even time now shines the darkness to despair. Church of God uh, Anderson, but uh, that's a Church of God song. That's a Church of God universal song. And those of us, uh, a lot of us know that from our childhood. It's good, isn't it? It's all James rejoicing over there. Because that's the story. We reach our hands in fellowship to every bud wash one. The church's jubilee. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Everyone obey God. The Lord surely been good to us. Yes, Don. Something on my heart if it's in order to share it, but I don't want to unless it's in order. Well, I, I, I feel good so far. You want to start talking? Uh, it's a song. Oh, wonderful. Then we'll be seated and you will come forward. Hallelujah. I need you. 
a lot of prayers because I'm not sung by myself for so long. When you're up against a struggle that has shattered all your dreams and your hopes have been cruelly crushed by Satan's manifested schemes when you feel the urge within you to submit to earthly fears don't let the faith you're standing in seem to disappear praise the Lord he can work through those who praise him praise the Lord for our God inhabits praise Praise the Lord For the chains that seem to bind you Serve only to remind you That they drop powerless behind you When you praise Him Now Satan is a liar And he wants to make us think that we are paupers when he knows himself we're children of the king so lift up the mighty shield of faith for the battle must be won we know that jesus christ is risen so the work's already done praise the lord he can work through those who praise him praise the lord for God inhabits praise, praise the Lord. For the chains that seem to bind you serve only to remind you that they drop powerless behind you when you praise Him. Praise Him when you Why, Doc, did you know that after we finished the, the church, the Church of Jubilee, I started to say, in the name of Jesus, be dismissed. He says, don't you do that. Amen. Jesus said, don't you do that. Amen. So that's why I said, has everyone obeyed the Lord? Amen. Boy, just as soon as she spoke, God witnessed. Now, isn't that wonderful? Amen. Furthermore, that song has got a range and a half. You have to have quite a voice to even tackle that. She's got a voice like her mother's. She could never have done it. Wasn't that wonderful? Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. See how marvel. Jesus says, don't you do that. I thought, well, Jesus, you've helped us so much tonight, and it's 9 o'clock, and maybe we can just go home early, you do, and let us think about this. He says, don't you do that. Wait just a minute. Isn't that wonderful? I, I marvel, because I was going to say, you're dismissed in the name of Jesus. It wasn't in the way today. He said, don't you do it. Hallelujah. That's great. Has everybody obeyed the Lord? Thank you, Don, for that. Oh, that helped us. See, it took a lot of courage for her to do it, but it, we got blessed for it. Hallelujah. Thank you. Everyone obeyed the Lord. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. <laughs> when you begin to talk about what he done for the pastors, you see, my mind went back. I was here when you came. Yes. We can't praise him enough. Yes. Right, that's right. And I, want, I just been back here praising him for what he's done for each one of you, for Pastor Steve and Linda and for Rodney and for Papa and Mama and mm -hmm. for you and Barbara and Terry and, mm -hmm. and Terry and, <laughs> and all of you. And then when Don, see, I never heard Don sing before by herself. And when she began to sing, it was in my heart because that was the praise that was in my heart. Oh, and so yes, I was yes, yes. Oh, praise the Lord. That had to be. <laughs> Glory. That's it. See what it did for, for grandmother. Hallelujah. Oh, that helped us wonderfully. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Well, this is a wonderful Sunday night congregation. A wonderful Sunday morning congregation. Thank you, Jesus. Well, I want to be faithful. Is there anyone else that needs to obey God? Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. She said to Henry, 
when they got found out they had cancer. Now, Henry, we're just not going to think about this. We're just going to turn this over to God, and we're going to live for Jesus. I got in the other day into their house, and he was at the door, and he said, Oh, Brother Hogan, just found a scripture that had to do with you. And uh, we just barely mentioned while we were there, you know, his situation, and but we had a lot of other things to talk about. All that God had done. I marveled at that. I never saw gray. I never saw, see, he just fell with cancer. I never saw anything. In fact, he didn't have time to talk about that, and neither did Parsley. It just wasn't on the agenda for the day. <laughs> Praise God. Hallelujah. But I, I wish, I wish we could learn from that. I wish we could learn from that. Because it didn't mean piddle. It just didn't mean anything. Henry, we're putting this aside. Now we're going to live every day God's going to give. That's all right. Uh, he's, that's what he wanted. And how's that? I'm, I think it's great. Well, yeah. Yeah. Praise the Lord. <laughs> oh, may God all, help us all to live like that. See, they really love Jesus. See, it's really something what God has done. Praise the Lord. Well, does that, does that conclude our obedience for the night? I would be so thankful. Praise the Lord. And while you're coming, uh, Debbie, your husband told me that you jumped straight up this morning some way. Why, he, he's never seen you do that before. I've never had either. <laughs> <laughs> she said she never had either. <laughs> I just wanted to praise the Lord for the many blessings that he's bestowed upon this congregation today. Thank you, And Jesus. I believe that if we always come to this church with a spirit of worship, his Holy Spirit will come down and be I believe us. it, Debbie. I believe it. Your father, uh, he was a, he, your father and I were the last to leave the church. I've forgotten what the last night was, Sunday night. And I'm telling you, he was talking a mile a minute. He got somebody in a motel room, told him about Jesus, and and shared with him a voice in the wilderness. And well, it was quite a it was quite a wonderful thing. Thirty minute conversation, and uh, it was just so wonderful. What a changed man he is! What a wonderful, wonderful deliverance. And he would sit there and weep and praise God, sitting beside you or just behind you, and he would just oh. He was just blessed over whatever was taking place in the service. So it was wonderful, and I thank God for him. Praise the Lord. All right. Yes, uh, uh, Doris. I just wanted to say that your sermon must have been a good one this morning because I kept falling asleep. <laughs> I want to apologize. No, that's all right. Anne was like that too. Now, I had one of the most wonderful anointings God's ever put on me. Maybe... Maybe a dozen times like that in 14 years. I believe but that. sometimes uh, you and others carry the load. Next time, maybe you'll be free and won't have to mm-hmm. carry that. But I believe that God's servants taught us that those who carry it help us get through and help us to yeah. get through to the right place. You're, you have a childlike heart and you're a very earnest person mm-hmm. and you love Jesus like a child. And so it's not unlikely that from time to time you'll have to have that burden, but that's good. Well, I don't want you to feel that you're bored I, I didn't when feel that, that happens. way at all. I know <laughs> what you're, you're not. Doing. No, I I felt good. I had to, for Jesus to help me like that was just a miracle, miracle, miracle. Uh, David said that he'd gotten a, already ordered the tape, and I'm so very anxious to uh, see his response. By God's grace, because I thought it was one of the most miraculous service that God's ever given us. I believe that with my heart. I only regret that Chase and Billy weren't here and everybody. I'd like to have had a 100% attendance. Uh, you know, they might have had to carry the burden, but maybe they wouldn't have had it and would have been free to have rejoiced with us. But we'll try to share. And it is on tape, and we thank God for that. Praise the Lord. Amen. That's because it. Because I'm free, for his eye is on the sparrow, and I know he watches me. That's it. <laughs> Glory. His eye is on the sparrow, and I know he watches me. Praise the Lord. All right, Jeannie.
We've had more spontaneous obedience today than a long time. I mean singers just singing when God comes upon them. This is a, a little song of, of healing and rest that, that the Lord gave me from my heart. It's sort of just a little devotional thing, sort of personal, but I felt like at the end of the service that maybe the Lord, well, before I came to church tonight, it kept coming to my mind, not, to, not the tune, just the, and to whom it may concern, <laughs> trust it'll be for someone. As the waters of Shiloh is my Lord to my troubled heart, as anointment balm in Gilead is my Lord to my aching heart. Hear my cry, Adonai, come still the storm in me. Hear my cry, Adonai, come heal the hurt in me. Pour the waters of Shiloh or my soul fill my heart with peace. When my heart is sad, balm in Gilead, with your touch Make the heartache cease. Hear my cry, Adonai. Come still the storm in me. Hear my cry, Adonai. Come heal the hurt in me. Dove of rest art thou, peace of God come now. Come my heart with your whisper light. With your wings of love, hide me gentle dove. Lift my soul out of sorrow's night. Hear my cry, Adonai. Come still the storm in me. Hear my cry, Adonai. Come heal this hurt in me. Amen. Glory. Hallelujah. I will try to close. If Barbara and Ann will come, we'll try to close with God is love. That's what He is. It's the expression of the day. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, yes. I just want to praise the Lord for the privilege of being here. I had to work this morning. I wasn't able to be here. And people would come in from church and I'd 
try to ask them, did you have a good service this morning? And I tried to get in on something anywhere I could, and, and they wouldn't say anything. I'd just say, well, you know, would you, would you, you know, I didn't want to be rude and say, well, what would your preacher talk about? But I tried to get on it anywhere I could, and no one would talk about it. They'd just go in and order their food and, you know, leave. So I'm just really thankful to be here tonight for the privilege of being here. Yeah, sure. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. sing the tenor on that after five years without any difficulty see I want to thank Jesus for that that I can sing with my family again and that brother Helm would say don't be operated on see he, Jesus would say no one year later Jesus said no and so I had to wait two years three years four years and end of the fifth year before my voice began to really come back normal isn't that wonderful Oh, I thank you for that. Would you like another stanza? I'm so glad you said that because I want to. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. That helped me. Boy, Bob put his hand up back there. Well, we'll sing it again. Hallelujah. 
You see, for, for me to sing the high tenor part and do it with no strain, it's just great that Jesus would help us like that. Praise the Lord. Okay, are you able to balance us out? I don't know. I'm using my mic. You okay, Keith? All right. I want to thank the Lord for the sound men. Uh, our regular sound men have, have been gone, and these boys have had to learn how to do it, and they've done a wonderful job. Praise the Lord. Well, this tells the story. It's not 9.30 yet. Glory. Hallelujah. All right. God God is love eternally. The Bible tells me so. Proven by dark Calvary. His mouth. strong Oh He'll never never change He's every day the same For God is God and God is love Though you failed and gone will testify, but Lord will still come. Who? Oh, Joy does? Well, hold it just a minute, Lloyd. Joy wants to sing. Wonderful. Honey, would you like to come up here where we can be with you? Oh, if we, Joy wants to sing, we want her to sing. Man. Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so, little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Amen. Thank you, honey. Thank you for that obeying Jesus and singing for us. That Wasn't that the debut? That was the first, wasn't it? Praise the Lord, we sure do do thank Jesus. See, if we can 
be natural and normal, then the children can obey God. And our hearts will be blessed. See, isn't that great? We thank God. Hallelujah. That helped us. Did you ever see such a service? I never did in my life. And in all of these years, the Lord's been so faithful that we really want to praise Him when we leave today. Try to review what God did for us today. Try to review the sermon. Try to review the songs. Try to review the obedience. The obediences. Just thank Him and praise Him and say, Jesus, thank You for this. Thank You for this. Lord, I remember that. Thank You for this. And if we'll review it, we'll retain more of it than we otherwise would have retained. Praise the Lord. Well, I've tried to be careful. And I'm so glad that somebody helped me not to miss her obedience there. Praise the Lord. Well, some people wiping tears. Hearts are blessed. Jesus is really being... What would it have been like if I'd have had every... every, A toast even. What if I'd have had every link filled? Every obedience. I mean when the service was moving like that. What if I'd had every link filled? See, that seldom happens. But see, if I see, you could feel it yourself. Steve said I could tell it. See, you could tell. It was just, it was, oh, just so important for every link to be right in there. See, we would have hit pay dirt somewhere by God's grace, and yet God blessed our hearts and helped us in a wonderful way this night. Praise the Lord. All right, if I'm not in too big of a hurry, I don't want to be careful that. God's not dealing with someone. Then we shall stand. Yeah, it's time to stand. Brother Lloyd. The Lord kept us 30 minutes longer than what I thought. And it was a blessed 30 minutes. Praise His holy name. Let us pray. Father, we don't know how to pray services this day. They've been so special, Lord. Oh, God, how we thank and praise Thee for Your love and Your mercy that You show us. We pray, Lord, for each one that's here tonight. We pray, Lord, that Thou wilt bless each one that has taken part. Lord, help us to be faithful to Thee, to yes. do Thy will. Oh, God, we pray oh, in the name of Jesus that Thou wilt walk among us, Lord. Help yes, us, Lord, Lord, to realize how dependent we are on Thee, Absolutely. Lord. That without Thee, Lord, life is worthless. So we pray tonight, dear God, that Thou wilt be with each one. Thou will go with us to our homes. Thou will give us protection as we travel. And Lord, help us to put Thee first in all things. We pray in Jesus' name.